One, two, three, go. There we go. One, just a second. One, two, three, go. We got her. Keep moving. Ooh, what's that? Surprise. <laughs> Either we're out here making whiskey or we're out here on our first ever off-grid hot tub date. <laughs> That's right. We just made it this morning. Let's see if this thing works. That's gonna go. This one needs some Leatherman encouragement. Perfect. <laughs> okay, the idea is this isn't going to leak bad. <laughs> it's going to leak a little bit. We're going for not leaking bad. Hmm. Oh, there it is. One and only. A beauty spring. Okay, you know why this spring is so exciting, besides all the obvious reasons? Is because right up there, that's where we're having the off-grid camp out. But we gotta get this thing heating up. It's gonna take hours. Let's do this. There we go. <sighs> Woo! We got water! You see that? I love it. It's very cool. Will it work though? Will it work? Oh, there's a flame there. That's pretty neat. Birch bark, I mean, that's that almost lights on fire just when you look at it. <laughs> yeah, right. Yeah, that's going. Well, that's gonna go. And check this out. It's been going for like a couple a minute, a couple minutes, but watch. <gasps> yeah! So we have this little dilemma of all these bits. Rose is gonna see if she can fix that. Look at our hot tub, it looks like the sky. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> wow. It is dropping cold. Wow, that's cold, eh? 5.4 degrees Celsius. So that's you know, five degrees above zero. Okay, well, let's see what it is in uh, a couple hours. Alrighty. Okay, once this is raging, we'll uh, go for a little walk and come back when it's hot. Look at this, Rose. Little mountain maple bushes. Hey? We'll have to take some on the way back. I'm gonna take some right now. Oh. I'm gonna put them in my pocket. And I'm gonna plant them in the greenhouse. In the greenhouse? Yeah, well, we'll get them started anyways early, right? Yeah, and then I'll for plant, sure. Put them outside. Maybe this summer we'll see little tiny mountain maple saplings. Saplings at our place. We'll see. So the spring's only, I don't know, a couple hundred yards there. And we're up on the ridge already. And this is where we're gonna carve out some beautiful little campsites. I imagine tenting right next to this guy. He's a he's a big beauty. Like essentially, we're not gonna change much. Like we're gonna leave it just the wilderness. But you know, we'll just have like a pretty little camp spot. And then we'll go down, you know, 30, 40 meters and, and have another little camp spot. So let's go find another one. Look at this spot. Look at these huge spruce. Oh, yeah. Four big spruce. 
and you can put a spot right in here. Look at this. Whoa. Ah. Whoa. Ah. Oh. <laughs> Help me out here. Oh dear. How am I gonna get up? <laughs> Woo! I'm fine. <laughs> Oh man. Oh beautiful. Yeah, come okay, we can have a site over here. We're really looking forward to seeing you guys. If you're interested in coming, uh, check it out on our website. Rose is gonna feed you every meal the whole time. And one of those meals is gonna be poutine. Abigail is gonna have her food truck all set up and she's gonna make poutine. Of course we'll have to like hike out to the road to the food truck, but <laughs> Make us feel a little bit better. Oh yeah, we're gonna like, we're gonna earn that poutine. <laughs> we're just about half full. Yeah. Hey, okay. uh, so there's still room. And look at this spot. You're like right on the edge of the, you got everything here. You got all the coniferous, and then you got this big popple stand. Oh. Birch. And then look at this, yeah, down in this flat, there's a bunch of birch and Oh, there's tons of birch in there. And cottonwood. Yeah. Workshop. If you're taking Dave's, yeah, woodworking workshop, you're gonna cut one of these down. And then you're gonna make it into something on the same day. What do you see? That tree over there has a hole in the top. I wonder if it's got a nest in there. Oh yeah, look at that birch. Sure does. Look at that. Happy little home. love it so we were having some problems with the uh, hot tub just before we left so I think what's happening well I know something that's happening it's basically like popping and <laughs> snapping and but it's not flowing like it flowed when the fire was started and I was like oh yeah but then as it warmed up the flow just stopped and it just became like erratic popping and snapping so I think what's happening is the fire is too hot for the amount of, you know, length of pipe and the resistance of the pipe. And it just can't flow fast enough. And then it's actually steaming inside the pipe. And then it just is chaos and it doesn't circulate. So I don't know if we're going to get in it tonight yet. We're going to see when we get back. But it was, we tried some things. We'll see. We're, I don't, if it's 20, we're going in. Like our bodies will help warm the water. <laughs> Right? Your body we're, can warm. <laughs> we're, we're pretty hot. I mean, with or without hot Dave? Oh, it'd be pretty awkward with hot Dave. <laughs> <laughs> it'd be a squeeze. <gasps> Stop! <laughs> isn't the, it? No, the top two inches are lovely. Yeah. The down below that is not. <laughs> the down below that? <laughs> well, we're going to get in there and warm it up. Oh! I'm gonna wait till you get in. No, get in. No, Hop in. No. What? I don't Rose, think. I'm filming. I can't get in right now. Oh, love. No, I really can't. What? Come on. Stir it up. Look, the water is steaming. Mm hmm. That's steam from the top. Oh, man. And look at our nice drinks over there kombucha. Rose, look at how picturesque this is. This is like Maui. Mmm. No. Yeah, it's just like it. A little different. We made it. <laughs> hey? Yeah. Barely. Barely. <laughs> so, the thing is working okay, but like we need to do some work. Something's not quite right. It was five degrees when we started. It is 23 degrees right now. That is not hot tub temperature. I actually think it's quite nice. <laughs> but Rose is like, when, when I said hot tub, Rose thought it was going to be like a hot tub. <laughs> not One like a, would think that a, that's what you meant when you said... Not a warm tub. <laughs> Lukewarm tub. But you know tub. what? You, next to that wood fire, <laughs> look very hot. But you know what we're going to do? We're going to We're going to come back and do this tomorrow. Are we ready? <laughs> Are you ready? I guess so. <laughs> as ready as I'll ever be. Kay. Okay, let's go. Aren't you going to, like... 
turn around. I can't steer. Oh, I gotta steer you in the right direction first. That would be nice. Okay. <laughs> Come on, are you sure you don't want to hop in? <laughs> nope. Come on. Rose, that didn't work. No. Ah. What the heck? <laughs> I can't even stop <laughs> Why'd you push me right into the bank? I did. You yourself. I didn't steer anything. You okay. We'll be back. Steer well, is it gonna work today? You see the steam? Oh yeah, I do. It is like cranking out of there. Is... Wait till we re wait till we take that our little cover off, <laughs> and we're just like we have a steamy spring-fed hot tub. Look at that. We got a little rager going. Oh man. Okay, get in. Oh, <laughs> fifty-six. Degrees. Right over here. That's that'll burn. You gotta turn it this way. 58, 59? 43 Fif down below. 39. <laughs> so the top couple inches is really hot. But I bet you, I bet you once we stir it all in, it's gonna be just perfect. You know how I know? We're getting in either way. Because you're gonna be in there. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, here's what I did. So I ended up um, cutting these a bit shorter. So now this distance is just over two feet, I'm gonna say. And then the coil, you'll see, there's just four coils. Like when I first did this, it was like, over 30 feet of copper and now it's under 20 and so the coil has a lot more like vertical to it so it's a lot easier to get flow so now the hot water is flowing the problem is there's less coil so the real solution instead of having shorter coil would be to have a fatter coil and you could keep it longer so three quarter inch coil okay if you're gonna build this thing three quarter inch coil I didn't have any so that's what I would do next time. Otherwise, it is pretty simple and it's working because we'll tell you the real temperature, but it's nice. Tell me what you think. It's hot. <laughs> oh, baby. She said it's hot. Oh, my. You're gonna have to take me out of here like in a long time because I'm not gonna get out. <laughs> this is so amazing. What's the temperature? Look at it. It's a it's an infinity pool where uh, we're flowing it. Forty one point four. Oh my goodness, is that safe? Yes. This is amazing. Rose, <laughs> give me five. <laughs> yes. We did it. Yes. The off grid hot tub, wood fired, just like an open fire. Okay, in all seriousness, okay. we lit this fire five hours ago. Okay, but I And just, we let it go out twice. I just wanted to say something to the Instagram... Yes. ...commenter... Folks. okay. ...who said... Yeah. ...like she was gonna get her husband to build this over... Yes. ...instead of the chicken coop. Yes. Yeah. This is way better than the chicken coop. Yes, this is better. I think we all have to agree this is better than the chicken coop. And I'm sorry, I know you didn't really want to see my boobs today, but there they are. <laughs> so what happens out here? Sometimes... Never mind. Yeah, I guess sometimes that just happens. Hey, look. You look like an angel. <laughs> I think it's the backlighting. Probably. But also you look angelic with backlighting. Oh, well, thank you. Maybe we could put some angel music in, just saying. Angel music. <laughs> to the fire. Mm. Hey. You look great. This is amazing. Yeah, it is. Am I your hero? Yeah, totally. <laughs> <laughs> okay, and look at this. We got homemade kombuchas and... A little treat. This from a friend. is homemade chocolate from a friend in Guatemala. You know who you are. Thank you, Levi. 
it is part of our very special off-grid spring-fed wood burning hot tub in the woods with kombucha and Guatemalan dark chocolate and rose. <laughs> You're amazing.